Hey guys, welcome back to another Friday night game night. Happy Friday everyone. Hope you guys have had a good week so far. Tonight we're going to be doing our uh, regular Friday night game night. So what we have is we have $21 bills along with our low priority sinking funds. Tonight we are playing um, this card game. So basically what I do is I have each one of these envelopes um, that corresponds to a number and we'll go through and shuffle our deck of cards and whatever card we pull out is the envelope that will get one dollar. Uh, so let me go over the categories really quickly. Now there's a couple of them that have uh, two different numbers just because I have more numbers in the deck of cards than I have envelopes. So pool is going to be number two or king and then land is gonna be number three or ace. And then all of the other categories will just have uh, one number. So meat is gonna be four, lawnmowers five, giving six, car tags is number seven, appliances is gonna be number eight, furniture number nine, remodel is number 10, electric, um, so we don't have an 11, so electric's gonna be jacks. And then phone, we don't have a number 12, so phone will just be um, queens. So hopefully that makes sense to everyone. I think I have played this game maybe once before, um, but I'm just trying to do something a little bit different. So if you guys have any ideas for different games we could play for our Friday game night, um, comment down below. Let me know if you guys have any ideas. So, and also tonight I will be doing um, my BCL shout outs throughout the video. So. All right, let's go ahead and we'll get started. All right, so let's shuffle up our cards and see who will get the first dollar. I'm not gonna count, I know that there's $20 there, so you guys probably don't wanna see me count that, so. All right, let's see here. All right, so first up is gonna be, let's see here, number three. All right, three is land. All right, so I'm gonna try to make sure that I keep track of everything on my little tracker here. Okay, so land will get one dollar. All right, so next up will be All right, let's see here. Number two. Two is pool. All right. So in this envelope, we haven't really had to pull anything out of it. Um, the only thing that we will end up doing is if we find, we do need some chlorine for our pool. We have enough for this year, uh, but we might get some for next year. If we find like a really good deal on clearance somewhere, then we'll go ahead and kind of stock up. That way we'll have it for next year. Um, we had purchased that um, a couple years ago. We had like a big thing of it. And um, so we've just been, using that for the last couple of years. Uh, but we are um, getting close to running out of that. So we will need some more next year. So if we find a good deal, um, we'll go ahead and pull that out and use it. All right, next up is gonna be a king. King is pool again, all right. So we've got two there. Okay, and hopefully I can keep track of how many dollars go where. I sometimes get distracted, so hopefully I can remember to write it all down. All right, so, um, oh, and I also wanted to do a shout out. So the first shout out this week goes to Save with Von A90. So that is Vanessa. Um, she does cash stuffings on her channel. She does savings challenges. Um, sometimes she has her kids on there doing their cash stuffings for their like savings challenges. Uh, so that is a lot of fun. If you guys haven't checked her out, please go check out her channel. Okay, so next up is going to be a number nine. Nine is furniture. All right, and you guys know that is my favorite envelope. I really want to get that one built up so I can purchase some furniture. So, and I'll go through at the end and I'll add up everything that's in these envelopes. I just don't want to count it. Um, so many times and like take up you guys this time um, Since you're here watching. I don't want to like waste your time. So 
All right, so next up is going to be Oops. All right, so next up is going to be, let's see, number 3. 3 is land. All right. Land. So that is going to get $1. So the next shout out that we're doing tonight is going to be Cash Rich Mama. So that is Auntie Mel. Uh, and she actually, she lives in Hawaii. So that's really cool. I love watching her channel. Uh, she does savings challenges. She does cash envelope stuffing. Um, she's got a little bit of everything on her channel, really. She is currently going through um, cancer treatment. So she's doing like chemo treatment for her cancer. Um, she's sharing that journey on her page. She shares, um, she does some like videos where she shows like the scenery there where she lives in Hawaii. So that's really cool to see. So if you guys haven't checked her out, um, go check out her channel as well. So next up is going to be number six. Six is giving. All right. So giving is going to be number six. All right. And so you guys notice that this is empty. I did pull out of this envelope. Um, so our kids are going to a Bible school this week and they are taking up money for like an orphanage. Um, so the kids are bringing in money each night for that. And I think so far they've raised like, um, I think last night they were saying they'd raised like $1,200 so far. Um, so, and then of course Friday night is usually like a big night. So I'm not sure how much they'll raise all together. Um, but that's where that money went. So I had like 30, maybe it was $33 in there. I can't remember exactly. It was 30 something. Uh, so they did put that money in at church. So all right, next up is going to be number three again. All right, land. All right. So, um, so yeah, like I said, my kids are doing um, vacation Bible school this week. So I don't know, is that something that is that they only have here in the United States, or do they have that other places? I'm not sure how that works, um, but I, I'll explain it for you who may be in a different country and you don't really know what that is. So um, they call it Vacation Bible School because they have it while our kids are on vacation from school. So they have it during the summer and kids are out of school. So they call it Vacation Bible School. Um, so it's just like you go to church um, every night for the entire week. I mean, I know some churches have it and they'll just have it as like a one day kind of thing. Um, but the one we go to, it's every night for the week. And so you, you just go to church. They have like, um, they have like crafts and games and they have a Bible lesson. And, um, yeah, it's just a lot of fun. It's a way to kind of get the kids involved in church. And it's a week that's kind of just devoted to them. And so sometimes they'll have food and that kind of thing. So let me know, those of you who are in other countries, is that something you guys have as well? Or is that something that we only have here. So let me know, because I don't know. All right, next up is gonna be number four. Four is meat. Check that off. All right, so our next shout out this week is a Budget with Bess. So she does cash stuffings. She does savings challenges. Uh, she recently shared on her channel that she got monetized on YouTube. Uh, so she did share like her first YouTube check and uh, how she was um, cash stuffing that. So if you guys haven't checked out her channel, go check her out. All right. So next up is going to be, let's see here. Number eight. Eight is appliances. All right. So we'll put one dollar in there. We'll mix everything up again. And so the other shout out this week, 
goes to a budget with Frey. So I've been watching her. I haven't watched her quite as long as I've watched the other channels, um, but I've watched her for a little while. She does cash stuffings. She does savings challenges. Um, I'm not sure if she's monetized. I know she did hit a thousand subscribers recently. Um, so she might be like in the process of getting monetized. Um, but she also has an Etsy shop. She has some really nice stuff in her Etsy shop. So if you guys are looking to buy anything, uh, go check that out as well. All right, next up is number four. Four is meat again. All right. All right, and it looks like there's still a few that haven't gotten any money, so let's see what we can do. All right, so, whoops. Let's see here, all right. All right, queen, queen is phone bill, all right. So that's gonna get a dollar. And, oh, do you guys um, remember last week I was talking about um, what envelopes I'm going to add next? Because these last couple envelopes I've just been adding to, like, get a month ahead on these bills. So, electric, phone, and then I said, next I'm going to add internet. And I couldn't remember if there was anything else that I was supposed to add. Um, but the other one that I couldn't think of last week was our TV. So, um... Yeah, I'll be adding those in next once something gets moved over. Um, so what do you guys have for TV? We have, um, we do Hulu Plus. So it's Hulu plus the live TV. And we also get Disney Plus with that. We don't watch that a whole lot, but we do have it included in our uh, subscription. Um, we have the live because my husband likes to watch... Um, like football so that's why we have hulu live um but we also have friendly tv and um i really like it it's like eight something a month um but you get like 30 something channels and it comes with like all the channels that i enjoy watching uh so you get like hallmark channels i think we get like three hallmark channels um you get lifetime uh you get um up TV. I don't know. There's a lot of channels on there, but it's a really good deal. So if you're looking to, um, get your TV for like a lower price, that's definitely one worth, um, checking out. So that is land. Land is number three. So it's going to get another dollar. All right. So let's see here. Next up will be All right, let's see here. Jack, Jack is electric, all right. We'll add one dollar in there. And see what we have next. All right, so three again, all right. <laughs> Land again, all right. So hopefully I haven't repeated myself any in this video. I did um, start filming this video and you guys know we've all done it before, but um, you get a little ways in and you realize that you weren't recording. So I did have to start all over. Um, so hopefully if I've repeated myself on anything, that's why. All right. Number nine is furniture. Yay. My fave. All right. Furniture gets a dollar. Okay. Next up. All right, let's see here. Three. All right, land again. Okay, 
Next up, mix those up just a little bit. Jack is electric again. All right. So if you guys enjoyed watching um, with this game, um, you should go over and check out Aussie a Budget Queen. She also does a game night and she usually does hers um, with the cards. So it's really cool to watch. Um, the only difference is she does hers instead of doing $1 um, because she's in Australia and they don't have $1 bills. She does hers with $5. So hers grows a little more quickly than mine. Uh, but yeah, it's a lot of fun to watch her as well. I really enjoy her channel. I watch her all the time. So giving is getting another dollar. That was number six. All right. So next up will be, let's see here. Queen. Queen is phone bill. So there is a few that didn't get any this time. And we've got one more dollar. So let's see where it's going. All right, last dollar is gonna go to seven. Seven is car tags. All right, that's good because that one hadn't gotten any so far. So car tags. Gonna get one dollar. All right, so it looks like the ones that didn't get stuffed are a lawnmower and remodel. And then it looks like everything else at least got one dollar. Okay, so let's go through and count our envelopes and see what we have there. All right, so pool now has 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. And I think to fully fund that one, just because we're not gonna have to buy anything else this year, I don't think, um, we'll just try to get that one up to 100 and we'll call it fully funded. So land, it has 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, and 46. And um, this one, we're just gonna keep building. I don't have an end goal for that one. Okay, so meat stock up is 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. So I think with that one, maybe my goal will be like around 200. That way I have it if I need it. Lawnmower, 20, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. And I'm not sure what the end goal is for that one. Um, cause I don't really know how much my husband's looking to spend on a lawnmower, but I do know he wants a riding mower. So I know it'll be at least a couple thousand. So giving just what we put in there tonight is $2. Next up is car tags. And the goal for this one is 360. So we have 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 in there. Okay, so next up is appliances. And this is just in case anything breaks, we can replace it. So we've got 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Furniture. And I am saving up. I think first I wanna purchase a new couch. So we have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I'm not sure um, how much that'll cost, but. Remodel has five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So we're just going room by room, kind of painting and um, redoing like flooring. So electric, to get one month ahead, we need 120. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in there right now. Okay, and then 
Our phone bill is right around 200 each month, so to get one month ahead, we need 200, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six so far. So that part is done, and then I will switch over really quickly to our fully funded envelopes. I only have a few dollars to stuff in there this week. Um, let's see, yeah, we have one, two, three, four dollars for those envelopes. And I just ha I just um, use like, I usually have a few dollars left over here or there, and that's where that money comes from. So I usually put in a little more, I usually do about seven or eight, um, but four is what I have this time, so that's what we're gonna work with. All right, so I have um, our picker wheel here pulled up, and I just use that for these fully funded envelopes just because there's not a lot of them and it goes kind of quickly. So, first one to get some money is gonna be, let's see here. So we have medical, home, oil, holidays, and gifts. So first up is medical. All right, so that one needs some money because it hasn't been getting a whole lot lately. So that's a plus. All right, next up will be medical again, all right. All right, three in a row. <laughs> that works. All right, let's see if anything else is gonna get any money tonight. All right, home is getting $1. All right, so that takes care of our fully funded envelopes. All right, let's count them real quickly and see how much we have in here. All right, so in medical we have 520, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. So $534 in medical. Okay, our home, that is just for any kind of home repairs that come up. It has 520, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. So 536 in there. Oil, that's our heating oil, and it currently has 500, one, two, whoops, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So 508 in there. And I'm not sure how much that'll end up costing. It was 400 the last time, um, but that was before everything started going way up. So I have an extra hundred in there and I'm building a little bit more. So eventually I am gonna pull that out and start stuffing some more each week, probably in August. All right, holidays. So um, this one has 100, one, two, three, four, five. And so 105, that is just holidays besides Christmas. That's like Thanksgiving for buying food or Easter for Easter baskets, things like that. Next up is gifts. That's for gifts for people that are not in our family. Um, that is like, you know, like a wedding gift or a graduation gift or if, we're, if we go to like a birthday party, something like that, just for people that don't live in our house. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, one, two. So 102 in there. All right, so I think that is all I have for you guys tonight. Um, thanks again for watching another video. If you're new here and you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button uh, just to help kind of grow my channel. So I hope everyone has a great weekend and I will see you guys next time. Bye.